A new UNAIDS report has revealed that 34.2 million people worldwide were living with HIV in 2011. Although rates of HIV are lower per capita in Asia than some other regions, Asia does have the second largest group of people living with HIV because of its large population. Mary Davis is more. The UN AIDS report released statistics that show HIV epidemics appear to have stabilized in most Asian countries. In 2011, there were 4.2 million people living with HIV in South and Southeast Asia, and 830,000 in East Asia. But the rate of HIV transmission in the region is slowing. There were an estimated 389,000 new infections in Asia in 2011, considerably fewer than the 440,000 estimated. Although the number of AIDS-related deaths are declining globally as a whole, the trend is not seen in Asia. Within the region last year, the number of people dying from AIDS-related causes totaled an estimated 330,000, the largest number of deaths outside sub-Saharan Africa. The HIV epidemic cannot necessarily be pinpointed to one country more than another, but it's concentrated in a relatively small number of areas. In China, for instance, six of the surveyed 31 provinces, autonomous regions and municipalities in the country account for 87.2 percent of people living with HIV, many of whom contracted the virus through drug injections. In Indonesia's Papua province, HIV infection levels are 15 times higher than the national average. In some Asian countries, key population groups are at a higher risk than others. There are largely concentrated among those using needles in drug use, those engaging in homosexual acts, and those involved in prostitution. About 16 percent of people who inject drugs in Asia are living with HIV. Mary Davis, CCTV.